Prince Harry has been tipped to win the Grammy Award for voicing his tell-all memoir Spare. The Duke of Sussex released his memoir on January 10 and Spare soon became the fastest-selling non-fiction book since UK records began. However, there is now reportedly a chance the father of two could win a Grammy Award for his audiobook recording. The prospect of Prince Harry winning a Music Industry Award was discussed by Roberta Fiorito and Rachel Bowie on the Royally Obsessed podcast. Ms. Fiorito said, someone in our listener emails actually pointed out the Grammys, because I guess you can win an award for audiobook readings. So next year maybe we will see Spear nominated. That would be wild, absolutely wild. Best of Britain. New £1 million coronation details unveiled with UK set for magical moment Ms Bowie added, I would be so excited. Prince Harry's memoir Spear includes a more than 15-hour audio recording narrated by the Duke himself. The Father of Two's audiobook also included several attempts at different accents, including Scottish and American. A segment of Spare was also mocked at last month's 65th edition of the Grammy Awards. King Charles sees popularity boost as Harry and Meghan's support base shifts to monarch Trevor Noah, who was hosting the annual award ceremony, was the dig while praising British TV host James Corden. He said, James Corden is a 12-time Emmy winner and the host of The Late Late Show. As also living proof that a man can move from London to LA and not tell everyone about his frostbitten penis. Prince Harry revealed he suffered from having a frostbitten penis following a 200 mile expedition to the North Pole in March 2011. Prince Andrew plans memoir in desperate bid to repair reputation, latest, Harry and Meghan handed golden opportunity to revisit racism claims, revealed, Charles makes thinly veiled swipe at Harry and Meghan amid fierce feud, insight, the Grammys first did out an award for best audiobook, narration and storytelling recording in 1959. Previous winners have included ex-presidents Bill Clinton, Barack Obama, and Jimmy Carter. Former First Ladies Hillary Clinton and Michelle Obama have also taken home the top prize. American actress and producer Viola Davis won the award in 2023 for her reading of Finding Me, 